Good evening and welcome back to Oxygen Not Included. I'm Modi Apparatus. Uh, we got some decor going on up here in the bedroom, and this seems to have worked out very, very nicely. Even this three pictures here, even without these plants here, the plants aren't doing a whole lot as far as decor goes. I mean, they are providing 11 for each one. I guess, I guess it's 11 for each. So I guess it is something, and there's no plants in them even. We don't even have to plant things in them, and they still produce 11. Now, they might produce more if we get plants in them, but we don't have any seeds at the moment. But, speaking of, I did notice we have 17 mealwood seeds now. We should really get planting some uh, mealwood plants. As people have pointed out, that's basically free food. Um, we don't need to worry about processing it then. Uh, we can turn off the production of this once we get the uh, that going, get a pretty, pretty decent supply of those going. I am thinking that we'll use this area here as our place for uh, mealwood, uh, mealwood plants. And, uh, yeah, I mean, the thing that bothered us before with these was temperature was the big issue, but I think if we keep it away from the temperature producing things, such as the batteries, uh, do the storages produce heat? What produces heat around here? Machines and that kind of thing, to keep them away from that. If we just have the water below this, that should keep it nice and cool. Um, and I don't imagine this water is going to go anywhere for right now. Uh, we're going to have to build around it, I think, and that's probably the best bet for us. I do want to get a tank build out here for uh, purification, though. Even though we're not going to be making, uh, we're still going to want to make uh, contaminated water into regular water. So we'll have a pool for that set up over here, but not uh, the regular water. We'll just build around for the time being. Um, that seems to be the the best way about going with it for now. So that said, I want to get this dug out today as soon as possible. Get this dug out today as soon as possible, and I probably need to put a dig order on that as soon as they're done with this. The, this is, un okay, this is unreachable, but this is the, this part's reachable here. They should get on that pretty soon. And then we gotta decide where we wanna put things, finally. Uh, there were some comments, uh, Lacey pointed out, or Lackey, I don't know, sorry about that, I don't know how to pronounce that name there, but, uh, Mr. Mr. Bandy said that, uh, having four high is, is not gonna work for all situations, because, for instance, this is three high, um, so if we wanna even have a kitchen, we need to make it maybe a five high structure, which is going to really mess up my levels here now. Um, but maybe we can do that someplace. Someplace where it makes sense, maybe building around something like this. I don't know. That said, we need more storage once again. Uh, putting it by the bathroom probably makes the most sense for now because, I mean, it's poor decor down there anyway. Speaking of, I think now that we have the decor pretty much like figured out here, we need to get these kind of plus, plus, uh, picture system everywhere. We need to have, you know, three masterpiece pictures above everything. And that's really going to help everybody's moods, I think. So, let's start getting that put in. Uh, we need some... Decor over here is not so important. This already provides 45 on its own. Uh, putting something over here might be a good idea, though. And... Well, let's see here. What does it take to make this? It takes 400 sandstone. That's, pl that's, that's nice and cheap, actually. Uh, we'll do the same system we did here, just have three pictures lined up like this. Uh, this room won't have the uh, flower vases for the time being, but we'll, we'll get to those when we can. Put those down here, and same thing down here, even even down here in the room that the room of requirement. Nobody's going to really use anything down here. Uh, we'll still do a couple pictures down in there as well. And that should provide plenty of decor for everybody. And we can have somebody who's ever on, I guess this is a, this is a construction project technically, so who's ever on construction will get this done. Uh, the painters have to paint it. But right now, we don't really have much going on for construction, so that's fine. We can get that done, get everybody happy. Um, we're not in any real rush to get too much done. The research needs to happen. We need to get ourselves a uh, place for the supercomputer set up, and that might be up here, possibly. Um, pr it produces heat, heat rises, so I would imagine if we want to put it up here, that'd probably be the best bet. Keep it away from the other areas uh, where it could potentially throw heat through the rest of the place. If it's at the top, it's already going to provide all the heat up there. I think the supercomputer also requires water, which they'll have to run back and forth for, which they're already doing for other things. Uh, so, priorities for now. Let's see here. I think I just want to set these priorities lower uh, for the paintings for now. Let's do these to a four. This wire I'd like to get done now, so it provides light for our LG terrarium, so those get done faster. I want the digging to happen first, so I want that get done, and the, this uh, placement of tiles can happen after. And then over here, we'll put an order to dig. Once this is done over here, we'll put an order to dig over here then. And this will be where we're going to put our plants, I think. It's temperate zone, as I said, again, away from machines and that kind of thing. Not We're not going to put anything over here in the water area that might produce heat. Uh, even this is probably producing too much heat for us. 
Wow, it's really, really hot. 76 degrees Celsius? That's incredibly hot. This research station is 79 degrees Celsius. Jeez, it would like burn your hands and touch the thing. I guess it's not that hot, but still, it's, it's, that's pretty hot. I mean, you wouldn't want to, you know, take a bath in water that hot. That's, that's uh, hotter than like a hot tub or something like that. Certainly would burn you quite nicely. That's like grabbing like a like a piece of steak out of the oven with your bare hands or something like that. A piece of piece a piece of food out of the oven or something like that with your bare hands, basically. Pretty hot, pretty hot. I don't know why these things. Maybe it's just, it's not the actual heat of the thing you're, they're touching, but I don't know. I don't know what that's implying exactly exactly there. All right, let's speed this along here. Let's keep it in high speed so we can get through a lot of days here. Delayed enough. Cycle seven already though. That's pretty great. This season, one thing I want to do is be much more careful about the dupes I select for the colony. Uh, we need we need quality dupes more than we need more manpower for the most part here. Um, yes, it would be nice to have a ton of a manpower and that kind of thing right now. Uh, but again, I want I want the good people. I don't want I want the I don't want the people that are gonna be troublemakers for us. So, research right now, we're working on the percolation, that'll get us the biodistiller, that'll get us the electrolyzer, we'll definitely need that for, the, for going forward, and water purifier, we definitely want that. Next, we might want to work on more energy. Uh, maybe we can bypass by building a whole bunch of manual things. We have so much hydrogen nearby, it'd be great to be able to use that. Um, and I think this thing produces a lot of heat, unfortunately, but... Yeah, we could totally do that, I think and uh, pump in hydrogen and I don't know what the output is for that just power probably I don't know if there's a byproduct but we have so much hydrogen around us we can have just one of these going and as long as we have enough power to run the thing uh, we'll be set after that we'll need to uh, set up some gas filtration right now because this is pure hydrogen over in these areas not here it's vacuum over here we don't have to worry about fil filtering it though if we can get a pipe into here and a pump and a little bit of power we could pump out of here, keep put the pump right at the top, and drag it over to here and uh, put it in this area. And once this gets dug out, that'll be easier to do. So we'll take an eye on how much they're working on the treadmill. It might make sense to have two people going on it. With only five people, we probably don't need two treadmills though. And just the one battery right now. Uh, once we get some insufficient oxygen generation, yeah, we still have, oh, our oxalite's actually going pretty, pretty much now. So we might need to think about more oxygen generation here shortly. All right, well, so a couple things we want to do. Uh, first of all, we want to get some power generation. So we're going to grab the hydrogen from here if we can. And if we can get that done and maybe in this area here, as far as uh, where we want to put it, we'd have to dig a small tunnel over to here, knock out one of these blocks uh, and get a pump in here somehow. And then after that, Yeah, I don't know exactly. I mean, how we avoid getting the whole base flooded with hydrogen right now? Research center idle. Okay, so they got the research done for that. I'm just going to do the basic researches while I have that set up here. I'll keep bump bouncing back and forth as we need it. Fertilizer maker. Let's do that. And uh, the, the other stuff there we don't... Actually, I don't want to do that one first. That one that one we only use... The only out of here... only thing we'd really use... I guess we'd use the fridge. I guess we'd use the... Fertilizer, ah, we probably won't even use that because it uses contaminated water up. Yeah, I don't think we'll want that either, and this one we definitely don't want. That's not worthwhile. Let's rethink that idea. Mechanized airlocks, liquid valves, and gas valves, maybe. Sanitation services, the only thing I might want is the airlock out of that right now. Shower's nice for stress, but right now we don't have a problem with that. Hopefully we won't. Ah, we'll just go to combustion. Let's get the basic research done for that now. And this thing guzzles down a lot of water, unfortunately. Each one of these takes... 75 kilograms of water. That is quite a bit. That's... Well, I mean, it's not a full tile. Well, I mean, it's a, it's a, it's a few... It's a, it's a few dips into the tile here, but... Still, it's gonna go pretty quickly. If we keep, if we keep using that as our main method of, uh... Skill increase for who? Athletics at four? Awesome. Might get him on power generation. Get him leveled up nicely. Alright, so. 
What are people working on that they're not doing? Okay, it looks like they're prioritizing the picking up of stuff, which is good. Oh, we need to set this for all. Yep. Absolutely. And this will give off bad gases if we let it, so... Uh, something to keep in mind. We got a little bit of bad, uh... Bad O2 going on right now. Shouldn't be too bad. Right now we don't have too many bad things producing. We have this producing, uh... It's producing contaminated dirt, but, uh, it's producing bad smells, too. And are these guys able to keep up? We need a this, uh, ceiling lamp, uh, powered up here pretty soon. Why are they doing this? Waiting copper. Oh, we don't need copper. That's the reason why. That would explain that. Uh, are we getting any copper? Uh, not anytime soon. Unless we set up an order to dig some out. Well, hmm, we want this thing to work at its full efficiency for the extra 10% bonus for each of those. So I'm going to put in a dig order uh, for right here. And we're not going to get that. The vacuum probably won't harm us too much if, it, if you do a tap into it. Not a big deal. Um, this thing's not shutting off yet, so it's still not hitting full capacity. That's good. As far as, uh, it'll hit, it'll hit full capacity as far as oxygen goes, as far as air density, and it'll shut off. We were experiencing that a lot last season. Alright, that doesn't need to be done for a while, so let's take a look at how many visits were left there. What are we doing on metal now? Well, oh, we're still missing, we're still missing a bit here. 25... Should be good. Should be done pretty soon here. All right, cycle eight is over. Or in, uh, yeah, cycle eight report is. We're into cycle nine next. Uh, they still worked on their digging project. They must be distracted by other things. Let's take a look at the priorities here quick and see what might take precedent over that. Um, all of their tasks would, because they're all fives right now. I could bump this up to a six, but I guess I'd rather take let them take care of their duties and then work on expanding. I mean, I want to get it done, because I want to have some progress every episode, but, uh, you know, it's about a huge deal to get it done immediately. And why do we just have that collapse there? Oh, is this a sand falling down? Yeah, we got a lot of sand, actually. Oh, is this set to a, is this a set to a five priority? Okay, we can probably lower that down for these. To a four. I just dig it out. I want to see a dugout before I want to see the, uh... There we go. They should take all this stuff then and fill up the last storage here. Once they're done. How bad is our oxygen generation? Cycle 8 was pretty close. Yeah, that was just because we bounced in. Day before is not that bad. We're pretty close on oxygen generation, so it's not a huge deal. Still, even though it looks a little scary saying insufficient oxygen generation, it's not that bad. We're in a matter of like 12 kilograms right now. It's not that much. We've done worse, for sure. All right, so this is our gonna be our area where we put the hydrogen processing. Down in here is where I want to put the tank. Uh, let's see what we got going on here. Uh, we got let's got some more building materials down in here. Okay, so now I have a, a I can put this as a five here to get this part dug out, and then I'll put an order in for this to get dug out next. And we'll put in as many plants as we can allow in here. Like so. Now this is getting a little wide on this side. So this is probably wider than I wanted it to be originally. Uh, but most of this is not going to be used. When we plan here, I think we might move this in just a little bit. Uh, we'll, we'll mess with it later as needed. But uh, we might make this a little more cut off here. And just put like processing stuff in here. Um, so they won't need to access it that often, is the idea here. Uh, basically, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to keep this as narrow as possible, but I'm going a little wider for stuff that, uh, they're not gonna need to walk into very often, like the, the tanks and that kind of thing. Um, we'll be pipe, piping out of the tanks rather than piping into them. So, yeah, there's that. We wanna make sure it's wide enough, the tank is wide enough to, new duplicates are available. Okay, let's take a look and see what we got. I don't think we'll pick anybody unless they're really awesome. Uh, 
Let's see. Athletics, cooking, digging, and tinkering. Eh. Diver's lungs would be cool. Uses less oxygen. Decor ex expectations is good. Tinkering's a four. Tinkering speed. When operating machines. Yeah, that's not bad. But then I have to make another bed. I might reject this first one here. Just to, I don't know. Wait, holding off for somebody better here. Maybe we have to start setting some minimums. Quick learner's kind of nice, though. They're not really good at anything else, but... Um, learning plus five is good. If they put if we put them on researching, they should learn other skills as well. Oh, I'm really tempted by this guy. Scaredy cat, can't perform combat. That's fine. No decor expectation. Oh, I might have to get Nori. That learning five is really, really tempting. And he doesn't have that bad of a... Uh, a negative trait. All right, we're doing it. All right, Nori, welcome. We'll have six. Uh, we need one more room added on then. Um, let's pause quick here and we'll add on another area for a room over here. We just add, a, make, let's add on basically just three tiles, really. So that shouldn't take long to dig out. Um, and I'll, I'll lower the priority on this for right now. Let's work on the other digging first. Get that bed built. I mean, he's got basically no decor expectations, so that's really great. You can just put him at the end here, stick him on the end. He won't care. Uh, put the cot in right here. Alright. We might need a second bathroom pretty soon here. Now that we have six people. And these are working at full efficiency. Yes, they are. Um, best they can do right now with what they have. So, there's that. Uh, let's see. The air scrubber was the other thing people recommended. And where is that found? Air scrubber. That is not found until right here. We can start research on this even though we haven't finished this one. That's interesting. I like that. So we can get some, a lot of the basic research done while we're waiting on a system for everything else. Looks like they're not, they keep hopping over this one. I'm gonna put the priority higher on that so they stop hopping over these two here. That'll get them building it, building it pretty soon. All right, everybody's got a bed. How's the decor on this side of the room? Not great. It's a 10. Negative 10. I mean, he's not super unhappy about it, but uh, I think if we just add in a plant, we should be fine there. Alright, let's speed it along. we got lots we need to do today still. I feel like we only have dug, dug out some area, basically was the goal, the, the amount we've gotten done today. Not, not a super commendable amount. Alright, how did that help the decor in there? Good enough, positive, that's all I wanted. 33, 1, 11 down here, and I get a 5 in his bed, okay. We might need to, we might need to put another painting in here. But once the plant goes in, it might change though. We have the seeds for these. We have one briar seed. Plant it. Well, I think I think if we plant one, we can get more. Uh, and then we'll start putting in the. Let's see, food planter boxes. We can start putting these in here, and we'll put a couple of these in there. Get those built uh, ASAP. Actually, get that get that stuff starting to get put up here. That was quick. Meal wood. Plant it. And gets fifteen hundred cal per harvest, one hundred cal per unit. Um, yields fifteen mealwood per harvest, and the core plus fifteen. So we don't even need paintings in here necessarily. We can get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, maybe eight if we put one right here. Wouldn't be bad. Eight's probably not enough, obviously, but it's a start. And uh, we're set so much food right now. I'm gonna suspend this for the moment um, and let them uh, work on their stuff. 
because it doesn't need to get done, and it's using up a lot of water, and they can work on getting other things done for the moment. We have we have 29 calories. It's 34 rations in the box here. That's plenty, assuming they don't go bad, which they might. But wow, love all the all the all the all the picture crafting going on right now. It's pretty amazing. So it's, it's quite the sight to behold. All the canvases are crafting at the same time. <laughs> Research center's idle. Did we get all the research done for combustion? Oh, that was quick. Uh, I think we'll do advanced filtration next, then? And again, we still haven't gotten the the next big one yet. Uh, that might go up here, because again, heat, heat rises, so we want to put it over there, maybe. And this was one, two, three. We did this right. Yeah, we did that right. Okay. And maybe we can make this one five high then. This leaves room for paintings, that kind of thing in there. So everything remains butimous. And these should really help with decor. They're not doing much right now, just blank canvases, but uh, they definitely will as, as, uh, as Nadia gets painting them. Nadia is painting them? Is that who we wanted? Let's make sure we have the best people. Creativity is a six for Melody. I want that done. Uh, cooking is a seven. Yeah, that's a good job for you. Okay, cool. Good enough for me. Let's make sure the, the best people are in art so they get masterpiece quality. Uh, masterpiece quality. Awesome. And how oh, is the decor looking in now? It hasn't updated it. Actually, you know what? These are so ugly that it's, it's not providing a net benefit, really. Even though it's providing a lot of... Decor, it's only 17 in here. Still, better than nothing. The algae terrariums are providing negative 10 each, so the more we put down there, the less nice it's gonna be. Okay, so if we really want to get power generation, first of all, what we'll need to do is get the uh, research for it done, which means we need to put a thing in here someplace. I think what we'll do is uh, we'll put the order in to dig this out. So we need to go one, two, three, four, five high if we want to make this be. Uh, our research room. And we'll put that going here. We need to bring power up to it. It's going to take a lot of power, actually. And that might be where we get a second battery and that kind of thing going here. That's going to basically put somebody on working out all day, though, to do that. But it's it's the nature of the beast for the moment. Uh, these are falling down, so I'm make sure these all get cleaned up, too. A lot of sand though, which is good. We're gonna need that for pur purifiers and that kind of thing. And cycle 10 is done. We're about to be. Uh, with this being as wide as it is now, I think I want to put some more gas permeable tiles through here. So uh, let's do it like right here. We don't have a lot of copper for it. So I don't want to go crazy like I did last time. And then actually over here too. Uh, we didn't put any in yet. So we'll go right here. Right here. There we go. Plant that. I guess I didn't click plant on it. And we'll actually build another one here too. While we're speeding through the night. Build a couple more. Oh, we need a we need this belt first. Okay, let's somebody probably had to sleep on the floor there. Let's set the priority higher on that. Uh so these get done fast. All right, those got done really quickly. Well, you're gonna need a lot more plants than that. I think we might want to put the plants someplace else as well. The further we get away from the center, though, the hotter it gets, and plants are very sensitive to heat, so it is something to keep in mind. But uh, yeah, it's gonna be the most tempered it can be in the middle here. Okay, so this is all dug out here now, and uh, looking pretty good. Um, they can't reach these last couple here yet. We'll put in an order for a ladder to be brought up through here then. Just so it's ready to go. And then, we'll put in the tiles through here. Dig through here, and maybe we put a separate battery over here for the uh, eventual station. Uh, supercomputer. Provides intermediary research. We'll put it like right towards the end here. So 
that's going to get the most use, and we'll need to run wire to it so we don't want to make it too far away. Uh, we won't run on the edge. We might want to run on the edge, actually. And then we can fill up the rest of this with batteries and power, 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 uh, power, uh, creation with the, with the, with the treadmills, not with the, uh, hydrogen, which we're going to get very, very soon. Okay, once that's said, uh, we'll switch our research back to combustion or percolation. Either one of the two. We'll do this one first. Switch it back over to there. That should get them working on that. Cool. Needs power. So we got power coming in. Yeah, we'll just run it through here. Or do I run it through the wall here? It's dead. That, that'll get them to dig this out too, which is fine. They can do that. And we'll cancel the uh, one right here. I don't think it matters. We can put it through the ladder. It doesn't really make a difference. Uh, let's see. We got another storage filled, of course. Uh, we can put storages up here too. Wouldn't be a bad idea. Uh, yeah, that's a good idea. We should put some storages up here then. Going for far, far over here. Yeah, actually, let's make two of them over here. Because we're going to get a lot of stuff gathered up from over here. Alright, so next, we'll get that research done. And we'll get our pump set up in here. We'll need a gas pump put in like right here. It will need power brought over to it. It will need piping brought over to it. We just go like this. And we bring it in to a... Once we have it, we'll put in the, uh, the hydrogen generator in there. And then we'll need power going over to this. So we'll go power from here. Over in here. And then, we'll see what they can actually reach. We might have a little bit of hydrogen escaping. Do we have an airlock re research yet? And we don't. All right, well, we'll get that soon. Uh, I might set the priority lower on this for the time being. Well, they can work on it. It doesn't matter. And all. And all. All right. Suffocating, really. Who? Oh! You fell down. Uh, why can you not get out, Bra Brayden? Why can you not get out? You should be able to. There is room here. Oh, you know what? There isn't. Uh, put a ladder through there and make it a top priority. This is emergency, guys. Save him. He can't jump three high. That's the reason there. The sand. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Save yourself. There you go. Holy cow. And then we can actually cancel these then. I don't need ladders in there. I just think they'll get, get out if they get themselves stuck. Who's suffocating now? Right in. Okay, good. He's good. He's good. Okay, crisis is averted. Glad uh, I should have paused it when that happened, but I, th I guess I pretty much did. All right, they're not going to reach much more of this after we get to a certain point here, which is fine. And then once we get this built, we'll big, make a nice big uh, battery here too. And maybe connect it over to here. Uh, this needs intermediate research. Go ahead. Needs bottled water, 25 kilograms for intermediate research. So that's going to be a lot of our water going to that now. Uh, I turn this off. We have still have 25 uh, calories, K calories. 29 meals for six people. That should last us a few days still. We'll wait to make more. Don't need them making food constantly. Especially when we don't have a refrigerator. It's not going to keep stuff, uh, not gonna keep stuff well. They're gonna get sicker if they don't, uh, if they have to eat this, uh, the stuff that's in there. Need briar seeds still, too. Alright, so who's our researchers now? Um, I wanna put, like, the best people on researching who are gonna get the best out of it, the most out of it. We need people who are good at tinkering or have good at learning, uh, and they'll get more stats, I believe. Well, learning they're already good at, so the researching will be fast. 
Uh, tinkering would also be important if they have that. Earnings a seven for Sadie. Holy cow. 41 research points per day. Yes, Sadie should be doing our research. Right, and then we have Melody on it for some reason. Nope, learning two, and then Nori's doing it too. That's good. Uh, and then we need people in Tinkering can do it too, I think. Tinkering 11, learning a one, that's fine. Um, yeah, so Nadia can do it as well. Let's let her do that. Because her Tinkering skill is pretty good. All right, how are we doing oxygen? Still insufficient oxygen generation. Uh, we're getting a little more, little more CO2 down here than I'd like. Um, what do we need to do with that? Uh, dig down further, probably. Yeah. Just put, keep putting it down a hole. And it'll keep just filling in the areas down here. Until we're ready to deal with it. Like, that's a fine strategy, I think. Uh... Inapplicable research. Oh, that's this one. Okay, yeah. Uh, we can deconstruct this if we want to put this in a different spot so it's next to each other. I don't think there's an advantage to it or not. Uh, it might be a waste of time to do that, actually. Uh, what we do need to do is put some decor in here, though, so they're working in a nice environment. Uh, decor. Blank canvas. I guess we could put the blank canvas above if we want to make this this tall. Or we could do both, actually. Um, and yeah, we'll put a tile, we'll put tile cross through here and make this a little taller room. Research suite is up here. Oh, you know what? We are going to run into a problem though. When we dig this down, our water here is going to fall and we might want to put one tile like right here to save some of that water. And I'm going to set this higher priority so it gets done faster. Just because... How are we doing on that research? How's it coming along? You know, one done? Really? That's it? Jeez. Because it hasn't been that long. Speed it along a little bit here, guys. And over here, actually, let's put in some more uh, decor here, too. Blank canvas can go... Well, we don't need it here, necessarily. We can put it over here, though. Needs it over there, for sure. Uh, this is still a bit drab down here, so I'm going to put in a couple more paintings. Uh, I don't think I can put paintings in here. It'll block the... Yeah, it'll block these, but these provide their own decor. So that should be fine. Just a little bit, but when they start growing, they'll provide more. And we actually have room for more, so let's put in some more of those in here. Food. Plant your boxes. We only have dirt right now. It's okay. It should grow nicely. And here. And we'll put in an order to dig this out. Okay, cool. Alright, well I guess with that we will take a break there for the day. Uh, we made a little progress here. We're starting to work on some passive food generation, not have to cook so much, uh, not waste so much water, and uh, get a lot more plants here, and we'll put more plants even down further over here. Now, temperature will become an issue over here, I believe. Yeah, it's starting to a little bit. As long as we're careful, we'll be okay. It's starting to get a little temperature in here, actually. Uh, this is producing a lot of heat, so is this. So we might want to move these further over here. Uh, since heat rises, it's better to put it at the top, I'm guessing. Um, and actually, if we expose this, this will cool it down nicely. Oh, maybe we want to do that quick. Let's put an order in to get over to this. This will this will definitely cool things down. Uh, dig. We want to go that far anyways, so let's do it. And uh, yeah, then we'll come back next time and continue to explore uh, our second playthrough of Oxygen Not Included. Thank you guys so much for all the comments, the tips, the likes are much appreciated. Let me lets me know that you're still interested in seeing more of the series here. So yeah, make sure you do those likes. I do pay attention to that uh, as far as when, when to know when to continue a series, when to let it go, and that kind of thing. So thanks again for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.